Hi, you guys. So we are ready for day two. I wanted to show you what I want to do in my yard. I'm not at home, but I want to show you what my future plans are. So I am planning to do this to my wall. And look at how awesome, how they have the pots hanging. And I'm thinking this would look really pretty on one of my walls in my, in my um, back under, under my patio. Uh, this booth is called, where's the name? Hang a pot. There you go. So this is hang your flower pots anywhere with amazing hang a pot. And it's really cool. Yesterday um, I was given like a little bit of a tutorial how, I mean, these pot, these hangers right here, they hold even the biggest pots, super heavy pots. Look at this one. This one is like full of rocks in here and it holds it really, really nicely. So this is actually, oh, and we're going to get a little demonstration. There you go. <laughs> so you see how these are and it holds look at that look at how cool so you know you guys i have something that looks like this in my patio but it's not with the actual pot so that's really amazing and then what's really cool is that you can actually have you know like a wood a wood panel built in your wall and it looks really really cool so i'm thinking of doing that in the future so that's really nice i was able to meet um rafa from hang a pot so that was oh there's your little shade cloth sorry rafa <laughs> no problem all right, so what Rafa also does is he makes an organic soil nutrition. And this is actually very interesting. This is made from snail poop. Wor worm, I'm sorry, not snail. So it's, it's worm wastes. And it's all natural. It works as a fungicide and a fertilizer. And look at that, he mixes all that up. So that's really cool. I might take a little bag and just experiment with that and let you guys know. So this is hang a pot. And that's the booth right next to mine. And hopefully today will be a good day. It's our last day of the show. <laughs> and let's see what else is going on over here. Um, so Todd, I think, got a really cool vanda from these people. And they have everything in bare root. And that's, that's nice. You know, it's, it's a little bit overwhelming to try to shop and, like, tend to a booth. So this is why I'm doing this early before the madness begins uh, this is accent orchids here and I found some really nice stuff they also have catacetums and I'm just walking in I said hi to everybody yesterday so I don't think they'll mind me just going inside their booth I hope not so this is really really cute this is a really pretty um, it's a fowl and these are like miniatures so these are really pretty here and this is accent orchids and they've got some catacetums and they've got some of the zygos remember i got that zygo with um at miami um at the tamiami orchid show <laughs> so this is this is pretty here they have dendrobium nobilis so that's nice we're all everybody's getting ready for day two hello good morning good morning <laughs> And then they've got some smaller ones in here. Oh, look at this. Wow, look at that one. This is really, really pretty. Not even sure what that is, you guys. So they've got tiny ones there. And there's this lady that makes these pots, which are really cool. It's like pottery with holes. Good morning. Get a donut. And that's that's really nice. Kind of remind me of the pots that I like to get. Very pretty. See everybody's like setting up and walking around. Everybody's getting donuts for breakfast. Hopefully it'll be really busy today. what they have here some pandas this is gross orchids and in Lakeland Florida and then there's Ritters I don't think they're here yet but this booth was jamming yesterday They've got all the orchids I'm taking home. 
well, I'm not taking home all their orchids, <laughs> but I'm taking home a few of the, or the orchids from Ritter's. They have really nice stuff. I mean, I've been dying, dying for this one right here, which is that pig hair one. Rasavola. Dig Diana. So I thought that this was a Cattleya. I'm not, okay, I'm a little bit confused now. Anyway, so I'm, I wanna get one of these. I'm definitely gonna get one of these dendrobiums. Uh, they gave me good luck yesterday when I had it in my booth and it's gonna kind of be a memory of my first show. These are the orchids that I used to decorate my booth. So that's nice. And they've got, ooh, they've got all the baranas. They got Barana Brown. Look at how pretty this one is, this antelope one. So Ritter's does have really, really nice stuff. Look at all the pretty dendrobiums. Beautiful. And they've got all sizes. Look at the zygo. Hope I'm not going too fast. Look at that zygo there, and they're not here yet. I hope they don't mind me coming in their booth. I'm sorry. If you watch <laughs> this video later, I'm just trying to show everybody your pretty orchids. So you guys, this is my beauty. They have it for sale here. This is my my Oncidium Rosy Sunset F and Ritter has it. If you guys want to get that, come over to the Tampa Orchid Show and grab a, a, um, an Oncidium Rosy Sunset F. They also have Sherry Babies and they have good sizes and they're it's at a really good price. I mean, look at their rosy sunset. Oh, it reminds me of mine. And there you go. So they've got beautiful. Look at the desert rose. Is this a desert rose? I don't even know, but these are beautiful. Everybody was walking out with these yesterday. And they also have stuff there. All right, so I'm going to go back to my booth. And I want to just show you guys... Um, yesterday was a really amazing day. I mean, most of my candle sales were to my subscribers and that was amazing. I mean, um, I was just there and you know, they, you know, you guys would come up to me and, and give me a hug and take a picture with me. And that to me was, was so amazing. Probably what made my day even better. Um, so that was nice if you guys came over and said hi. Um, I really, really appreciated that. I also want to show you the little gifts I got. So I even got lunch. So I got a, a subscriber, Edith, which is, oh my God, such an amazing, good morning. Such an amazing, um, amazing person. Um, Edith, thank you so much for lunch. She brought me lunch. Um, me and my husband, we split the lunch. So that was amazing. Um, and I got, let's see. So Todd brought me over some goodies. Uh, I got this Vanda and right now, um, he did give me the names, but right now I I don't remember and I would have to um, get out of this video to look for it. So uh, this is what I got from Todd. I got this beautiful, beautiful Vanda right here. I got this tree that's edible. Moringa, I think, something like that. Um, I mean, I'll do a haul at home and I'll, and I'll show you guys. That was from Todd. He also gave me a cutting from his big mama, Catlea. Look at how beautiful. I'm so excited to mount, to mount that on one of my oak trees. I got this, this cakey from Vincent, which is um, so amazing. Thank you, Vincent, very, very much. And I got a dendrobium from Rebecca. And, and she brought that to me. Um, I have it here under, under the shaded area so it doesn't get, get messed up. So it's a... That's a dendrobium from her. You guys, I got gifts. I'm so excited. Blanca brought me, Blanca Acosta brought me some soap that smells amazing. It's like handmade. So, you know, I'm feeling the love over here, you guys. Thank you so, so much. Um, and, and just you guys, everybody was so amazing. I mean, I loved it. Let's see what today has in store for me. Um, my candles are doing fantastic. Sorry, I have to put my sunglasses back on um, let's see so this is my booth and here's my signature collection so I've got um, I've got four fragrances in my signature collection 
I've got um, Orchid Garden, which smells amazing. I've got Jasmine Vine, which also smells amazing. Um, I've got the Cocoa Bamboo, which is um, coconutty and a bamboo. And then I've got a Sherry Baby, which is, which is, <laughs> which is like a vanilla, a vanilla chocolate. It reminds me a lot of my Sherry Baby. So that's my signature collection. Uh, then I've got um, some holiday, some fall fragrances right over here. I've got the pumpkin, the apple cinnamon. I've got gingerbread and marshmallow. And then, and then I've got these um, customized like home collections. So it's a little bit about my candles. Um, and that's it, you guys. Uh, hope you guys come out here and enjoy this pretty show. Um, oh, and my, my next door neighbors right here have really cool stuff too. I was looking, I was admiring their cordigeras and telling them how, how mine didn't survive too much. But this is Brendron Orchids. And they've got some coconut orchids, the maxillarias, and they've got some mini fowls. And then, of course, like yesterday, I love these centrobiums right over here. Oh, and then here is a lady that I always see in every single orchid show. I think she's from Orlando. Um, I forgot what the name of this booth is, but I always see her. I came to say hi to her yesterday. And then she's got some rosy sunset F2. Look at these pretty ones. Oh my gosh, this is so, so pretty. This is so, so pretty. And this is a dendrobium. Oh, let, me, let me see where a tag is. You guys, I'm gonna get in trouble. I'm going into everybody's booth and just like looking. So that's a tag for this dendrobium or yeah, it looks like a dendrobium, but it has a different shape. It is so pretty. So I'm thinking of maybe getting one of these too. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so <laughs> everybody's wondering what I'm doing. They came up to me like, what are you doing back there? Just doing my usual, my usual vlogs for my channel. <laughs> Oh my gosh, so day two, this is the last day. Um, I'll be driving back to Miami after the show. So it's gonna be a long day. And, um, and that's it. I hope you guys that um, are in the Tampa area come and visit me and say hello. My husband's been a great help. Um, he's been uh, helping me with, with everything this weekend. So that's, that's great. A lot of you guys got to meet him. So, and that's it. We're getting to work. Uh, it's 9.45, so the crowds just are getting here on 10, and we'll see how it goes. Next time I post, I'll probably be back home, and I'll show you guys exactly everything that I got in a haul. And um, that's it, you guys. It's been, a, it's been nice. I wasn't that nervous, and um, kind of getting used to this. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys liked day two. Um, if there's anything, uh, that you'd like me to see if they have leave me the comments below. I'll walk around in a little while and That's it. Thank you for watching Mwah. See you soon. Bye